So it's no surprise that I'm a foodie living here in Barbados. Of course, I had to hunt out and find the best food, y'all. But instead of just giving you my five best places, I decided to bring a friend on board. Come on in, girl. It's Sabrina from Bayesian Lifestyle. Hello. All right, so I wanted y'all to get a local and tourist perspective mm -hmm. on the 10 best places to eat, all right? And we are gonna categorize them. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna get the first five on my page and the last five on her page. So definitely make sure you check out Sabrina. Once again, Sabrina will give you everything you need to know as a tourist from the local perspective. So it's like the real deal information. Definitely. Need, Authentic Barbados. Yes. You ready to do this? Yes, let's, let's do it. Let's go. Really quickly before we start, mm -hmm. one thing I realized is New York taste buds are on a different, in a different space, right? Oh, We're kind yeah. of like one of the meccas of cuisines. And so I've learned to put that aside and mm -hmm. judge it on a more universal perspective. Mm -hmm. So let's jump into it, shall yeah, we? Let's do it. All right. All right. So the first category is Bayesian food. What's yours, Sabrina? Mine is Tim's in Bridgetown. It's a beautiful restaurant on Swan Street and the food is all Bayesian. Love their macaroni pie and their baked good. pork. So the good. The pork was good. The pork yes. was good. Okay. And that was in your it was in my food tour video, yes. so you guys definitely have to make sure you check that out. Mm -hmm. So I haven't been to this place, but I heard it's pretty good, so I'm going to throw it on this list, all right, because Tim's was actually mine as well. Uh -huh, yeah. So I'll give you guys an extra one, Velma's. I hear Velma's is really uh -huh. good. I don't know exactly where it's located. I'll put the link down mm -hmm. below, but check out Velma's. I heard from a local mm -hmm. that it's really good food, okay? It's good. I haven't tried it either, so we should actually try it. Yeah, we yeah. should. Joe's, a lot of people like too. They have good mac and cheese. Have you tried their mac uh -uh. and cheese? It's on the East Coast, Joe's. So y'all just got three. We're gonna give you a couple of bonuses, all right? We gonna yeah. go over 10, all yeah. right? Yeah. The next category is nightlife. Nightlife, okay. What's your nightlife? So I think I would say cocktail kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> So it's the same for both of us. Yeah. Honestly. I mean, okay, so my personal reason is every time I'm looking for somewhere, and we're talking about like somewhere for like nightlife vibe mm -hmm. that's surrounded by mm -hmm. nightlife, so you can literally walk over to like wherever you need to go. Yeah. But whenever I ask for recommendations, I always get cocktail kitchen. Yeah. And it is a, it's a vibe because yeah. there's a lot of people there. Mm -hmm. People are getting, you know, like pre-gaming, I guess, mm -hmm. and eating as well. The food is good. And the food is good. We love the food there. The food is good, yeah. The drinks are good as well. The drinks are good as well. Yeah. They are. And it's in the gap. So if you're not feeling the vibe there, maybe it's a little full, obviously, because it's a hype and everybody wants to go there. There's still Cafe Soul. Oh, you can go to other places. Mm -hmm. I do like Cafe Soul too. Yeah. Their drinks are strong, y'all. Mm -hmm. So that is a great place to Keep start your night. <laughs> Designated driver as always. Please, please. please. And yeah. you only need one. There's two for one drinks. You only need one, trust yes. me. Yes. Oh, yeah. Crave is also good too. Oh, I haven't tried yeah. that. Yeah, Crave is good. I like Look at Crave. that. Like I said, we're yeah. giving y'all bonuses. Yeah. All right, so we're at the middle. Stay tuned so you can get the rest of the restaurants, mm -hmm. guys. And then we are going to chat about street food, favorite scenery, mm -hmm. et cetera on Sabrina's channel, yeah. all right? All right, so the next one is brunch. Yes, what's yours? Pavao. Pavao mm -hmm. in Sweetfield Manor. Mm -hmm. Because I feel like that one is just, I'm gonna say it's a vibe again, mm -hmm. but I just feel like when I think about like what I'm used to for brunch in New yeah. York, and there's like kind of like a party vibe, there's a mm -hmm. DJ playing, it is beautifully decorated. Mm -hmm. We will cut to some of the scenery and whatnot, but in addition to that, you step into the hotel, mm -hmm. like it's beautiful in there. There's a lot of Instagram yeah. ready moments, yeah. including in the backyard as well. Peacock. And the peacocks. No, how could I leave out the Yes, I left out the peacocks. Yes. The peacocks are there as well. Yeah. They're beautiful also. Mm -hmm. So it's just to me, when I think about brunch and what it entails on a Saturday, mm -hmm. oh, the drinks are good. I should have told you about the food, right? The yeah. drinks are very good. I had the hummingbird buzz. Ooh. And then like chicken and waffles they have. I had that and that was good as well. So that would be my pick. I haven't gone, but I definitely will be going now. For myself, mine's would be Cosmos. And this is, Cosmos, okay. yeah, Cosmos is a little in island a little bit, still south but a little bit in island. I'm sure Shaz can put the link in the description for you guys. Yes, yes. But what I love is that the portions are so big. There's <sighs> so much beautiful. food. <laughs> so beautifully placed. Um, everything comes on these little like um, little wooden. Um, oh, that's cute. Cutting boards. Okay. So cute. And the, the staff are amazing. So I love, I love how awesome. so I'll have to try that one because I haven't tried that yet. Yeah. If you've been to any of these places mm -hmm. and you're loving them, like drop it in the comments mm -hmm. below. Let us know what you liked about them. Once again, sharing is caring. Mm -hmm. right so let help us, us all yeah. yeah let us know your favorites okay what's the next topic south versus west coast south versus west mm -hmm. coast so let's do yours for me on the south it would be Apsara 
Sarah, it's an okay. Indian restaurant. It's in Sonora Gap again. So all these amazing restaurants are in the same location. But Apsara is right on the beachfront. The ambiance is just so romantic and yeah, so nice. Yeah, it's really for nice. It's like an Indian and Thai place, mm -hmm. right? Okay, so they really so go in on the flavor. Decor. Yes. Oh, that's what I need to hear. Mm -hmm. So maybe I'll check that place. You out. have to. I did go in there and I really did like think it was mm -hmm. beautiful. It did feel like you stepped into a, a new world. Yes. You're it not in Barbados anymore. No, yeah, 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 for sure. It kind of feels like you're in Thailand. Yeah, mm -hmm. Thailand meets India, exactly mm -hmm. what the theme is. In Barbados. Okay, and yeah. your West Coast? My West Coast is Seashed. Okay, Seashed, yeah. why? Again, I had that same feeling of I'm not in Barbados anymore. Yeah. I thought like I was in the Bahamas or like Thailand. Again, somewhere exotic. These two locations give you that sense of you're no longer in Barbados. As much as Barbados is beautiful and all of that. I'm Barbadian. I need a little different. You okay, get me? So I need sense. I need that to feel sense. that I'm not here. Mm -hmm. So that's why I love um Sea Shed. Customer services. Perfect. Customer service was really yes. good, yeah. Um, and you can sit on the beach, which is nice yes. too. Yeah, yes. that it was, is a good vibe. Yeah. So mine are, actually, if you want my South and West, you're going to have to head over to Sabrina's channel to check out our remaining bunch, okay? Yeah. <laughs> We've got a few more uh, topics. We've got street food, mm -hmm. scenery, and good vibes mm -hmm. in terms of when you want to like just see great people out. Yeah, and I'm chill. particularly talking about folks our age, millennials. Mm -hmm. Yes. This is where you're going to go. So go ahead and head over to her channel mm -hmm. for that. Go ahead. It's right there. Right there. Click. 